What's up guys? It's your boy, Son of Beast. Today's matchup, as we will get to this one, it's the All-Star Week. This first up starting of this game, as you all have made it to this part of the All-Star Week, it means it's time to go things into the board. As of right now, I hope you all enjoy your Anime Insanity Invitational new episode of number 12, plus the Devils and Blue Jackets. It was an amazing night. Tough to be here for the third quarter to make the tie game for the Jackets. And a shootout win for just for Brad. Well, I hope you really enjoyed that one too. But now, let's take a look at the Rising Stars. We never showed you here before as we're about to do this one now for the first part. And then the second part, we will have Team Giannis versus Team LeBron for the All-Star Game in 2023. This time, after Cleveland, it's time to go to Utah. This is where they played here for the first All-Star Game. If you don't remember this uh, documentary, this one was definitely the only thing we have. As we have USA, Jaden Ivey, Bendit, Matt Hurin, Keegan Murray, Paolo Benchero, and Jabel Smith Jr. going up against Team World of Josh Giddy, Jalen Green, Scotty Barnes, Evan Mobley, and Al Perrin Sengen. Now it's time to send you over to the Vivint Smart Home Arena, home of the All-Star 2023 of the NBA, to get started, where Kevin Harlan, Greg Anthony, and Doris Burke are standing by. I'll keep you guys tuned here on Halftime and the post-game show. Let's get going. stage these young guys are on tonight. For so many of the fans, Greg, who are still, uh, you know, just getting familiar with these players, it really is a great welcome to the NBA moment. It really is a showcase. And for each player, whether they have great moments or not, just being chosen to participate is a huge honor. And it says a lot about where they stand amongst their peers. And for as much offense as the All-Star Game features, I mean, the Rising Stars Challenge typically gives us even more scoring. I mean, this is an action-packed event year in and year out. Here's Mobley. And the rejection by Smith. A lot of great plays being made here on the defensive end. That indeed is a rarity. The highlights are almost always on the offensive end of the floor. 
this one. And then the Bird Show. And guys, he's not an easy man to stop, but he's got the rim in his sights. Never has been, never will be. He is a determined finisher. And guys, I like the fact that he chose the one hand tomahawk slam because you get a little higher when you go off one hand and one foot. And it's Team World with the ball. Following the bucket by USA. Three inside the three-point line. And they hit it back. Hopefully he misses. Well, he knows he should have knocked that one down, especially with the defense not giving much of an effort. Smith the best in effort. He kicks to Murray. Smith the best to Van Carroll. Here's Murray up on top. Here's Matherin. And the three off chart. And for me, this is always one of the best weeks of the year. So much fun for everyone involved. Fans, players, coaches. What a blast. Yeah, the NBA knows how to throw a party and celebrating its game. There's no doubt about that. An all-star week. One great show after the first day five. Number five. This first personal foul, first team foul, number one, team one, number three, OG, and Jacinta, shooting two. On the floor, the signature events of all our team USA and team world. Everyone in the mood for all the festivities. Oh, no. and it's Perfect. Such a great way for these young players to show off some of the fancy moves that they wouldn't even dare to attempt oh, in a regular was. season game. And good, it's involved. But the Rising Stars Challenge has seen its share of miraculous performances in the past. And I'll always remember David Lee going a perfect 14 of 14 from the floor in that 2017 year. He wore a He's perfect shooting for their scores in 2025. The score was the second team coming, carrying all the lines for USA. Williams. The awards in those games. The line for two. Remarkable nights that were put on display by those guys. Still, if you, if you want to talk about pure explosiveness, though, I think no one has been able to top Kevin Durant's 42-point effort back in 09 in this contest. Phenomenal performance. Yes. He misses the three position on the position for the court. He has something in Team USA, so 14. <laughs> John Griffin. And USA making a change here. Griffin's checked in. Good on the second free throw. Just under three and a half minutes gone here in the first quarter. Alvarado pays it to Wagner. Thank you, Wagner. Wagner. Can't switch the contact. Play right close. Wagner fighting for that finish. And that was the mole one drop. Well worth a second look. And the awareness of his footwork and body of oh, that drive. Wow. Here's Nemhard. Pass to Williams. Here's Nemhard. Pass to Sohan. Two minutes remaining for the first, first, first period. Two minutes. Why not two one down? Two ball. Shot shot. You allow him to get that close, you deserve to get scored on. Here's Alvarado. Pass to Wagner. There's 138 left in the first. 
USA trails by three. Pass to Matherin. He kicks to Ivy. Murray outside. On the pass time. Here's Matherin. And they come right back with the three of his own. It's no good. Here's Parks. And he gets the whistle. USA foul. Number 23. Ivy, his first person of all, first team star, the line for Team World, number four, Scotty Barnes, the line for two. Defensive, racking up the points too. And I really like how they move the ball tonight. Because of this selfless approach, they are piling up the assists. That's good for Barnes. Substitution for Team World. For USA. Number five. Change for Team World. Islands checked in. Josh Lutton. Lutton. Now for Team USA. Paolo Banchera. That one is no good. USA trails by four. Stolen by Mobley. Here's Barnes. It's all in by USA. Durange got his sixth rebound on the night to the left wing. Here's Matherin. Good D by Mobley. Team World getting by four. Outside Green. Fires top of the key. It's all in by USA. Seven rebounds in the game. Dan Carroll passes to Duran. Plays it off and two. Do it! He's got six. Texas is fantastic. To the inside. And that pass is going to have a moment. Dan Wolf at the game. Kalen Duran. Position for Team World. Number 28. Tom Bachdorff. Here's Nemhard. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. Passes it to Durant. And stolen by Mobley. And Mobley! USA trails by six. Two minutes to play in the first half of the game period. For two minutes. One fifty-two left in the first half. A nice shot. Griffin. Here's Highland. Here's the Murphy. Here's Highland. Pass to Shengu. Right wing. And here it is, Griffin. USA. USA foul. Andrew Nedra. This first was a foul. Second team foul. Substitution for Team USA. Germany. Now let's watch that terrific swat. And boy, did he get up quick to reject that shot. That's as fundamental as defense gets. Almost finished for the first half here, and then we'll get to halftime. Here's Highland. Mobley trying to bring some Google. Highland. He's got the lead up to six now for Team World. On the pass to Sohan. Over Murphy. And the shot is long. I wouldn't say that's exactly his spot now. I mean, and you can see why. Longer. Holy kicks to Shangun. Passes to Highland. Great pass to Sohan. No, 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 And now it's an eight-point Team World lead. <laughs> Number three, and so hand missing. Nimhard, the pass to Griffin. Six on the shot clock. Another shot. He's going to get him. And he gets the basket. Very good. Do it. So a chance at the line for one more. Hey, there, kiss Well, you can't give him a World foul. Not highly. This force, personal foul. 
Halftime show. Well, it's greeting dings again. It's time to take a look at your Rising Star Challenge in between by the Team World and Team USA. It's a lot of playing phenomenon. As you notice, that they're ascending and there's a couple plays by Franz Wagner. And there's some tougher plays at this moment, like Banchero and players. However, definitely did get over it. Team World really on a good shot. Really got some threes, really got great rebounds, trying to hit it off to the point. And for Team USA, they might need something else to go back to it instead. Only got one block, but they need something else to try to stick it up. Anyway, that should do here for the first half of the halftime show. It's time to click you on the flip side. As we go right into Kevin Harley and the crew. I'll be back with the post game show. See you later. Young fellas can play. They are putting on a show. USA trails by nine. Smith is out there with Van Carroll. Van is Ivy. Then there's Murray. And it's Matherin in at the two. Ivy. Ivy for three. Second half for USA.
and the first one at the line is good. Lots of tough players in this action, but hopefully you'll see the real games that they will all be underway. So make sure you keep your eyes tuned on that one. Good for Mobley. And with a little over a minute gone, the second half is on the way. Ivy takes to Murphy. Passes it to Van Carroll. Pinch in shot. Evan Mobley with the rebound. Mobley's got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. Getting the pass to Barnes. And by the 
to your local to your local Kia dealers. Visit yours today and look at your local location of the Kia dealers. Team USA is going to pick a lot of plays in this moment because there is one thing that they need to get there. Try to keep it tight at the perfect condition. That's what we really need to get this thing over. And before with that one, skills challenge, three point contest, and slam dunk are all excellent. We want to hear that one from you. Hope you enjoy it. It looks like Team World could be going for a win of the Rising Star Challenge. We got fourth quarter coming up after this. And a chance right now to show you our State Farm Assist of the Game. And the definition of teamwork right there, guys. I mean, what great communication between them. And, and what a beautiful feat. For me, next to the big time alley oops and monster throwdowns, passes like that are probably the next best thing when it comes to sweet looking NBA highlights. Welcome back to the showcase of the amazing young talent in the NBA, the Rising Stars Challenge. And it's not hard to tell just how much fun these young guys are having out there tonight. That's exactly right, and the same goes for the fans. I mean, they're having a blast too. What a terrific event this has been. So, Team World has stopped. Arms out there with Alperin Shangoon. And it's green, then there's fire. And it's giddy in the water. Here's Nemar, following the bucket by Team World. Fast and Hathrum. Takes a 
to Van Carroll. Shoots over Wagner. And it's Van Carroll missing. Two more, leading by 13. Giddy with it. Al Smith defending. Good work, Josh. Giddy. 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 Gidd
pass to Dan Powell. He's open up, but it's no good. Team World leading by 14. Barnes outside. Now, Giddy. A pass to Mobley. Ranks Bogdar and for Team USA. John Jaden Ivy. He's perfect from the line this time. USA trails by 16. Over to the left wing. Murray kicks to Van Carroll. Oh, it's good for USA. Deep World Round, number four, and Mobley. First and foremost, though, is a team foul. On the line, shooting one, team USA. Oh, Lancho. One shot. One shot. Substitution on the court. Don't forget, coming up later will be. The real all-star game, that will be Team LeBron and Team Giannis. Keep your eyes tuned for that one. And free throw, good from Van Carroll. Team World leading by 13. Here is Mobley. And he makes the... Oh, Mobley! Much earlier, before the game was out of reach. USA a foul for USA. Eddie Williams. They're determined to add to the league, not with more offense, but with big time defense. At the line, first line for Team World. Number 22. Bounce walk on. At the line for two. For Team USA and Team World. Number four, Bailey Green. Is growing as a passer. And Josh Giddy, number three. And for Team World. Referring, I keep on Murray. All three throws good from Wagner. The USA. Without time out ball by Team USA. They're trailing by 15. 36 seconds left. And with the trouble plays, we will have a look at the Rising Star Jordan Dugan's player of the game. We may not have anybody out there to give it a go. Let's have a look at the player of the game. Evan Mobley. And he's put on a terrific show of skill in the paint. A, a combination of moves, footwork, and that soft touch down low. It's all added up to one dominant performance for the big fella. Teams need contributions from everybody to win on the road. Not just the start. And he's done more than his share tonight. An outstanding performance. And it's Team World with the ball. Following the miss by Jabari Smith from deep. Highland passes to Mobley. Mobley. It's good. Evan 
Boy! Team Boy leads by 17. Great job of passing the offensive line. He stayed with him. That's hard nose, tough basketball. Murray outside. Passes a dive. USA ball. Looks like it's you know, USA ball. Like ball. Last possession for Team USA. Here's Ivy. <laughs> The end of the game, the final score of the Rising Star Challenge. Team World, 70, and Team USA, 53. How talented up and comers we have here in the NBA. Great, no doubt. There are some future greats among the players we saw here tonight. And we're pleased to have brought you all the action. So now for Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. This is Kevin Harlan saying good night, everyone. Kevin Arlen, thank you very much for your for your love and support. We appreciate you, and we hopefully we'll see you again by the time we will have another one. You keep it on going. Anyway, with the tough ones being said, a lot of stackability runs for the team comparison in between by the two of the world and USA. There are so many, a lot of them, that they were bringing out free. A lot of fast breaks, points in paint, second chance points, defensive rebounds, and a steal. The fouls, dunks, biggest lead, and time of possession. That field goal was turning out to be a lot of heavy runs of Team World. And right now, they have already won. And with the same thing that goes with last season, and they really haven't caught on that moment. Because of that one, it really has to turn things over with a ton of games. Let's have your three star players of the game for the Rising Star Challenges. As they're all Team World. As we take a look from here, we have is... Jalen Green with only 10 points and only two dunks. So that is the excellent three pointers that he has made two in a row, and field goals was four out of nine. The second star goes to Alperen Sengen. That's 11 points, 11 rebounds, three assists, and a block. That is definitely true. Because he only made three pointers once, and the free throw was only two. He was excellent. Really well played out there to go with another one. And your number one star of the Rising Star Challenge goes out to the New Balance star player of the game, Evan Mobley. 18 points, 12 rebounds, 1 assist, 2 steals, and 1 block. Only one dunk has performed and definitely well phased on the field goal percentage. So that is it for part one. Stay tuned for the second part as you will have Team Giannis facing against Team LeBron. Here for the second part of the game, as we will have a commentary up with you in just a moment. So, we'll see you on the other side. So, thank you for watching, and peace out everyone for a while as the Rising Star Challenge dial. This is Summit Beast. Good night for the first part. We'll see you on the other side if you're sticking with us. So, don't go anywhere. We got you more underway after this. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.